Hey everybody, the Bonga is back. Welcome to part 26 of Let's Play Dynasty Warriors 4, brought to you by GameAnyone.com. Alright, in this episode we begin Act 4, The War Against Liu Bei, and we got three levels to choose from. Obviously I'm going to pick the battle of Boan Po first, I almost said, first I'm going to piss the battle. <laughs> that would have been so weird. Okay, so I did get Xia Hodun up to max rank, so now he can take a fourth item slot, which is going to be great for us. So what am I going to fill it with? I think I should fill it with... Oh, this is a tough decision. Uh, speed scroll? I don't know. Let's find out. Elixir, not worth putting on right away, because it's only level 1. So I think I'm actually going to go with the speed scroll to run a bit faster. I think that's what I'm going to do. I might, like, migrate over to the Elixir if it was at a better level. But, only at level 1, you're not going to notice much of a difference. Alright, welcome to Bo An Po in Jing Province. Zhuge Liang is an unparalleled military genius. That's true. He will definitely have some kind of scheme. We must be cautious. Yeah, sadly not every one of us is very cautious. Just rushing in recklessly, like Dian Wei, for instance, going after Zhao Yun right away. So he's gonna try to fall back. Maybe we can cut him off from the other side. Otherwise, there's gonna be a fire attack. That's why Zhao Yun is falling back. Trying to get us caught. Is running all you are good for? And you know what's gonna happen next. We're gonna be caught in a fire attack. So, if it's gonna happen, it's gonna happen. We might as well just take him out. Oh, Liu Bei and Zhuge Liang are gone. Looks like they're plotting something. Oh dear. Oh man, our advanced forces have been wiped out. Carelessness brought about this result. We cannot underestimate Zhuge Liang. Yeah, we gotta be a lot more careful now rather than just ru rush into traps. You won't break through here. Hey, Zhao Yun, where are you going, man? You wanna fight? Did you think you could break through our forces? Oh man, he got away. I don't know if he's gonna come back. Did you think you could break through our forces? An ambush party here? We will have to fight our way out of here. I am sure Zhuge Liang still has a few schemes. Defeat enemy units one at a time, so we may foil his plans. Alright, so we gotta take care of enemy units individually, just to avoid any ambushes. And there's gonna be quite a few around here, like Lu Feng, Lu Feng for instance. So let's just take him out, how about Dian Wei? Oh! Don't even think about it, man. Oh, I'll just set my, my bodyguards to attack mode. There. Oh, we'll get some items for this. That's good news for us. We must not fall behind. Yeah, that's a good idea, Shu Wong. Who knows where Lu Bei and Zhuge Liang went? Oh, there's more forces around over here. Oh, I'll take this. Eugene is fighting, fighting Guan Ping. Okay. My spear shall answer all. But can it answer my kids love to taste the cinnamon? Oh, I already made that joke. So you wish to die quickly, or slowly? Huh. <laughs> oh, come on now! I was blocking. I don't understand how you were able to block that. Ow, ow, ow. Hey, I was hitting you! Oh, trying to finish this, man. Now I gotta be extra cautious myself. Gotcha! I'm not the best duelist, trust me on this one. I shall withdraw for now. Okay, that takes care of him. 
And I was trying to help out Han How. Speaking of which, here he is. He's playing Jian Yong. So it's nice to actually get one duel that's successful on this particular campaign. It's the first one I have. And, and against a tough opponent, too, Zhao Yun. I still don't understand, like, every time I block, I tend to still get hit. And I was blocking right in front of him, so how do he still connect? Like, I was... I swear to God, I had the right angle. But what happened? Uh, I guess the world will never know. Any sub-generals around here? Uh, just one ping, okay. This might be a trap, but we might as well fight him. Did you think you could break through our forces? Well, we'll just have to beat him, that's all. There's no reason not to, right? Ow! There. Get another item. Hopefully it's gonna be at a good level, or maybe the Vorpal Orb. Cause that to me is the best one you can get. Oh, Guan Yu showed up. Deal with it calmly? So rather than just rush right into him, I'm just gotta wait for him to make the next move. We must all follow your example. That might be our best course of action. Or we could fall for another trap. Uh, I'm actually going to decline this duel. Oh, there he is. On top of red hair, no less. Alright, let's fight it out, man. First, I gotta clear out some of these bodyguards he has around him. Otherwise, it's gonna be very problematic to b battle him. Oh, it's problematic now because that Muso. He's got some power on him. Still need to worry about increasing my defense. Ugh. Oh, this might be a good chance to do some damage. I think I got a lot of it, though. And I think I just lost a bit of sound there, so it's going to be desync, so give me a few seconds. Alright, I'm back. Let's continue on here. Thankfully, every, the audio is back to normal. We would be back to normal if we can just defeat Guan Yu without getting destroyed ourselves. Just open things up a little bit. Oh, there's some health. That was well needed. Where'd he go? Oh, there he is. Oh, knock me into the defense up. Huh. Just needed that. Oh, man, don't get juggled now. Oh, extra attack power. I want that too. Yes, gotcha. Did I misjudge this foe? No, you misjudged these foes. Remember, it's a team effort. I may have gotten the weapon experience, but it was a team effort. Hmm. Hit us where we're most vulnerable? Probably our main camp. So we should head there right now. It's about to happen. They got no other units left, I believe. Nope, that's all of them. But... I know something bad's about to happen. I should know. I've done this level before on my own time. And look at our morale, it's very, very high. We might as well just go in here. Oh, there they are. They've returned. Liu Bei and Zhuge Liang are here. But our supply depot is on fire. The supply depot has been engulfed in flames. Oh, there's Zhang Fei. No. Now, sometimes I'll accept duels 
early in the battle. Later in the battle, maybe in some random circumstances where I do an interim save before then, I might accept. Otherwise, I will decline, because I don't want to lose all that progress. Oh, don't be such a wimp, Shoo Shoo. We're doing just fine. I mean, sure, our morale has been cut in half by the entire board as a result. However, we're still killing them. We haven't lost an officer, really. What the hell are you being so wimpy about? Oh, now Jubileon's here, too. So yeah, we've got some very tough numbers to deal with. Oh, don't you dare go after my bodyguards, John Fay. Now it's just going to be one massive scrum inside of Burning Depot. But it's just going to make it more intense. Oh, missed that. Kind of wish you could just adjust your angle automatically. Like whenever you try to manually do so. Oh, this might be my chance to beat him. I might be able to beat, beat both of them. Did I get both of them at the same time? I'm out of here. Wuss. And I defeated Jugaleon at the same time. <laughs> you can still hear the deadlock. Sound effects, that's so funny. I don't think that was meant to happen. We must not fall behind! Where is Liu Bei, anyway? He's all the way to the north, I believe. Ah! I think I need to kill all these guys. Otherwise, they're just gonna keep harassing me! Like, stop it! Just die now! Here, my bodyguards are helping, too. Good job, everyone. It's a team effort, everyone. Oh, archers. They gotta go. Well, your crossbowmen will first. Let's see if I can take out all these guards first. Then I might consider, like, a dealing with Liu Bei itself. This is not a difficult mission. Trust me on this one. It may seem that way because it feels like all your units are just falling for traps. However, I mean, you still gotta beat the officers, and if you can do that, they mean nothing. Yeah, what, what are you bitching about? Just come here and join us. You don't need to be over there. You're probably just fighting peons anyway. Oh, don't even know why I grabbed that elixir. Uh, get around him. There. Thanks to my bodyguards, I was able to flank him. Uh, just a little bit more. He's got quite a bit of defense on him. As to be expected, he is the boss of this mission. God damn. Oh, jeez. He's charging up his Muso. Gotcha! I cannot die here. Not before the Han is restored. Okay, you'll just die somewhere else then. Uh, we still haven't put out those flames. I want to do that. Alright, so, our items... Eh, seems like a very crappy haul. Either way, life is al almost at max. Muso is at max. Attack is getting there. Defense only halfway. We're gonna need to fix that shortly. But Jahodun is one weapon level away from level 9... I mean, level 10 weapon eligibility. So, let's see the story for the next mission. As Cao Cao's army heads south, it is met by a force led by Liu Bei's strategist Zhuge Liang. True to his reputation as a genius, 
Zhuge Liang utilizes various intricate schemes and tactics against them, but in the end, it will be Cao Cao's cunning and the might of his officers that will prevail. Defeated, Liu Bei's army flees south to Changban. It is apparent that Liu Bei means to propose an alliance to the Sun family of Wu. For that, Liu Bei would need to travel by ship down to Changjiang. Alright, so I'm gonna stop the video right here. In the next part, we begin the Battle of Changban, and we have to make sure Liu Bei doesn't escape. See ya, everyone.